Hello everyone. Welcome back to my channel. I am your girl, Lawan Hines Rome. I want to come to you today to speak with you about my month-long experience with Wagovi. Wagovi. W-E-G-O-V-Y. Wagovi. Um, I was talking to my daughter earlier this morning and I was telling her why I decided to use or go ahead and accept what my physician was talking to me about in regards to this particular weight loss management drug because I had been doing everything that I felt like I needed to do to lose the weight, going to the gym. I was going to the gym Tuesday through Saturday and sometimes I was doing doubles. So when I'm at the gym, I did like a five, 10 minute cardio workout on the elliptical. I would do a five or 10 minute walk um, on the treadmill at the end of my workout with the elliptical at the beginning of my workout. And then in between that time, I would do my weight training, which was fantastic for me. Um, and then I would also do sometimes in the evening, like at least three days, maybe two to three days a week, I would do my fit on app where I was, whereas I was doing fit on in the morning, I changed it to do on my fit on in the evening. And I go to the gym in the morning with my husband. In addition to that, I share with you guys that I have been fasting, fasting Monday through Friday. I would stop eating by 8 p.m. in the evenings and I wouldn't eat again until about between two to three. Sometimes I would go into 5 p.m. With what Govi, um, it has controlled my appetite completely. So I really had to make sure that I was careful with doing that, especially for the first month, because sometimes I would get down into six and seven o'clock in the evening and think, you know, I haven't had a real meal. But one of the reasons why I started taking it was because I was telling the doctor that in doing all of that, I was not losing weight. I would see the weight drop off two or three pounds, but then I would see it back on again a couple of days later, two or three pounds or two pounds back on or a pound back on. And that was frustrating. I'm sure you can understand that. That was totally frustrating. Now I could feel my clothes fitting differently. So, you know, I'm assuming that it was the inches that I was losing. I didn't measure myself in that way. I did just measure myself on the scale. Um, but I didn't want that. I was getting tired of that. So she suggested um, three different types of uh, medication for me. And the one that we decided on, because I am not diabetic, I have some high blood pressure from my third pregnancy, which was 14 years ago. Um, and of course, since then, I've lost quite a bit of weight, but have gained maybe about 30, 40 pounds back um, with all of that said and done hormonally, she thought that Wacobi would be the best fit for me. And today, I think that that was the right choice. I have done Wacobi for one full month. It is done 0.25. And uh, I actually marked, you can see where I have marked on my box, my dates. So that kind of keeps me on track of when I took it and the time that I took it. Uh, and it's just, it, it's done well for me. I was almost feeling like taking this um, 0.25 was really not doing much for me in regards to weight loss, because again, I was still seeing some of that same kind of pattern of gain and lose and gain and lose. Um, I would weigh myself in the evening, which I told myself I wasn't going to do. I was only going to do that weekly. And I talked to you guys about that in the last video. But I did. I weighed myself um, sometimes in the evening just to see where it was and what it, what it looked like. And then I would weigh myself again like the next day or the morning of the following day to see what has happened. And sometimes it was pleasantly a drop, um, but other times it didn't seem like, you know, it just seemed like it plateaued on, the, on that one, the 0.25. However, Friday, I weighed myself. That's this Friday, Friday past, and I was 213.6. Okay. Last night, <clears throat> I weighed myself again um, just because I had had one meal yesterday. 
Um, and I stopped eating about 10.30 p.m. last night because I ate kind of late, about 7-ish yesterday. So I had one meal last night, and then I stopped eating completely at around 10.30. I was watching the movie, The Equalizer, with Denzel Washington, and I thought, let me weigh myself again after I've eaten that meal and I've set, so let me see if it's done anything. And I got on the scale and it said the same thing, 2.13, actually 2.13.8. So it went up 0.2 um, ounces. So early this morning, because I've had like a sinus infection or something going on, I've not worked out for like the last four days. I've really just been doing some uh, weight training stuff, real minimum, just trying to keep myself moving and activated, not a full-fledged workout. But this morning I got on and it said 211.2. So I am actually excited about that. And I'm praying, 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 praying. Uh, you guys pray with me. I'm praying that that stays uh, what it is. And of course, I see some drop. I will begin the next dosage 0.50 on Thursday. Thursday, I will begin the, the second increment of doses. So I am very excited to see what that does for me. Um, when I do this next video for you guys, I think I want to incorporate a little more of um, some information on what Wacovi does and how you can actually see some increase, I mean, decrease in your weight based on what you should be doing um, with your weight loss. Okay, I look all dolled up because I have to do another video for um, my job and then another video for a client. So I thought I'd put on a little makeup. How I look. Mwah. <laughs> but anyway, guys, I didn't want to come and be before you long. I just wanted to share that with you. I'm already seven minutes, which is about three minutes too long than what I had expected. But nevertheless, I just wanted to come to you and talk to you guys because I said that I would do so. And I am trying my best to be consistent in doing these videos for you. If you like what you see, you like what you hear from what I'm talking about, please just like my video. If you want more information or if you want me to discuss more about any particular angle or anything about my experience, share that information in the comments and I'll get back with you. I do believe that I've included my email address. Um, if you have any questions about anything, you're more than welcome to send me an email. Okay, I love you guys. Talk to you soon. Happy, happy, be healthy. <laughs>